Ooh, mama. Ooh, ooh, mama. Ooh. Let's take a look. Uh. Uh. Okay, we are live. What is up, guys? Fat boy here, and we're back. Bit more vamp here. How you guys doing? Hope you guys are having a wonderful time and let's get to it so last we left off we were well basically stuck well not stuck here but we rich we managed to find the skull a skull base i guess like i guess lucid skull i don't know man i mean they're not killing people so anywho so we're supposed to go find harriet jones so uh, well, not really fine, because I know where she is. <coughs> Hello, Harriet. Do you recognize me? Hmm, <coughs> yes. You were from the Pembroke Hospital. The young doctor. So full of secrets. I have so many questions I need to ask you, Harriet. If you would. I love questions. As for the answers, you may not like them. How do you feel? I can't see. I can't move. Oh, my, my body's burning. I feel as if I'm dying over and over again. Have you tried to eat or drink something? People here tried to feed me, but I'm just not hungry. I don't have the strength. Oh, does the pain ever stop? It is not pain I feel. It's like I, I can't stop feeling every inch of my body. But at the same time, each muscle and bone is the wrong place. Mm. Your room. The blood. What brought you to fake your death in such a gruesome <coughs> fashion? To see if I would be mourned. Why flee with Sean Hampton? Oh, it's always a pleasure to see a saint fall to sin. But the coward still won't kill. Huh. Do you take pleasure in causing so much pain and sorrow? Nobody gave a damn about me. Not a tear shed. Poor Harriet. Always the discarded. Why did you come here? And why not? This is where I live now. Leave me be. Will you respect old Bridget's wishes? Will you obey her? Bridget is kind. She only needs to keep me fed and I'll be good. So you desire to stay here? Yes. I'm with my own kind. Birds of a feather, so to speak. Like, half of face is like... Always alone. Half a face, half a body seems to be mutating. Look at the arms here, man. Like, <coughs> I have a question of the utmost importance to ask. Will you answer? Questions, questions, questions. The good doctor always searching for answers. Do you remember what you did after leaving the hospital? Did you kill anyone? First, a question from me. You answer first. Very well then. What do you want to know? Are you like me? Are you also dead? We are not dead, Harriet. Death no longer pertains to us. We are different. I like what I am. I truly do. I relish the pain that courses through me. I know you fled the hospital with Sean Hampton. Did you or Sean kill anyone in your flight? Anyone. Try and remember. I will not lie. I 
wanted blood and I wanted revenge and Sean pulled me from it, brought me here instead. But the shadows heard my prayers. The shadows killed that bastard. Oh, wish bastard. You sought vengeance by your own hand and someone else obliged you. Very convenient. Don't lie to me. I don't lie. I saw him near the docks, and rightly I wished him dead. And I am happy he is. It's true. But I didn't kill him. I was too tired. Oh. Who was that man? The one murdered in the street? He used to be my landlord. I lived here for many years before falling ill. Oh, he was an awful man. Disgusting. And cruel. So cruel. Okay. Shadows. Tell me what you saw. The shadows. They heard me and answered. Something in the deep darkness. Quick. Deadly. It asked me if I wanted revenge. I answered, yes. And these shadows, this presence, do you still hear it? Was it a vampire? Did Sean see it? It spoke only to me. And now it is silent. But it is born of hatred. Ooh. And it will kill again. <laughs> and it hates you, Doctor. Oh, it hates you. What makes you say that? It, it whispered your name, Dr. Reed. It wanted to know who you were and where you went. Questions about me? What did you say? Nothing, Doctor. I said nothing. There was nothing it didn't already know. Oh. Oh, I'm tired now. Let me rest. Okay. Have you found the answers you were looking for, young Ekon? There is too much left unanswered. So many questions. Get to know us. Spend time with us. And I may be willing to answer more questions. Why do you live here? Amongst the filth and vermin? Live? Here we hide. What are you hiding from? Ask a lot. From the guilt? Oh. The shame from the hunters and the light, and of course, our past. Why don't you leave the city? Hide somewhere far from the guard of Prewan, the Ascalon Club. We are the Sewer Skulls. This is our domain. We have run as far as we can, and now we hide. Your diction, your words. You do not carry yourself like most Skulls I've encountered. True. I'm not like most Skulls. You were once someone else. What happened to you? It is as sad as it is long, young Ekon. But it will remain mine. Can okay. I be of service to you? We ask but one thing. Reveal to no one our secrets. Do not betray us. Mm, okay. For how long have you been in hiding here? Skulls have been hiding under London since vampires first entered the city. Where did you hide before the sewers? We claimed ancient tunnels, forgotten caverns, catacombs. We are skulls, groveling beneath the feet of our makers. What manner of creature is Harriet? She is different from everyone else. I really don't know. I'm not even certain she is a skull. I've no idea as to what blood made her. What is a skull, in fact, in your honest opinion? The progeny of a vampire, disavowed by her maker. Perhaps a fruitless branch of a noble tree. A word used to enslave us. I cannot say. You mentioned that vampire blood has tremendous potency. You believe it to be stronger than your own? Oh, the vampire's sweet blood. That rich, dark wine that we crave. 
For it made us, and it can sustain us. I thank you for your time, madam. I must go back to Sean Hampton now. Your kindness has been ample payment, Ekon. To protect us, I'll close the access to our hideout, but you can use our shortcut to reach Mr. Hampton's shelter. Oh? Just follow the arrows. Okay. Thank you. Well, I mean, we really know where it is, because... And again... shortcut up and then we need to go back to the hospital I mean hopefully the exclamation mark doesn't go away because from what I know it's like if you these are like certain events that only happen once in a while like during like certain cutscenes like not certain kinds of, like certain it's events, long, like. but then once you, if you miss like a certain time frame to get them, it's like they're gone forever. So, welcome back, Doctor Reed. <coughs> Would you like to take communion with me now, Sean? Are you eating raw flesh? It is the sacred flesh of the mortal lamb. Our Lord's bountiful transmutation for the sustenance of his believers. Okay. Thank you, Lord. I am your most humble servant. So, true to your word, you waited for my return. I told you, Dr. Reed, I was a man to be trusted. Did you have words with the poor Harriet? Oh. You make no distinction between the living and the skulls, do you? We are God's children, Dr. Reed. One and all. And he's determined to save us. What will be the result if you continue to assist both skulls and the living? For the last decade, that's what's been happening. And they found a better life. What's to change? You're forgetting the epidemic. Things can go south very quickly. I've seen it. Oh, these are terrible times. Only those pure of heart shall prevail. Hmm. Okay. You've turned Scal now. Don't you see the danger to anyone giving you their trust? We are all sinners, awaiting salvation. This is a simple truth. Ordained by the Lord Almighty, I am a seeker of his glorious light. Does this place belong to you? How can you be so certain you can keep it open? This warehouse was once property of the Dawson family, but has been bequeathed me through donation. The Dawsons? The wealthiest family in London? Have they a clue as to what goes on here? Not at all. The donation was made before the war. The building was run down. I never met Aloysius Dawson myself. Oh. So you have the run of the place and no one's taken notice. As long as we keep to ourselves, we interest no one. This is a haven, and I pray it remains so for eons to come. Harriet, Miss Jones has been behaving in a most violent manner. She's going to need special attention. That's precisely the reason I brought her here. To meet old Bridget. She's the guide Harriet requires. Oh. Who is this old Bridget? I don't know, Doctor. She rarely speaks of her past, but I know she has a long one. Uh -huh. She's likely the oldest soul in the city. 
Harriet is possessed by her hatred. You cannot let her roam free. She's dangerous. She has joined her own kind, Doctor. Old Bridget is a saint to the younger Skulls, guiding them to salvation and peaceful existence. Ah. I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm certain you've killed no one, but one day I believe you'll cross the line. <sighs> Logic is a false prophet. Faith is the only path to salvation. What do you mean? We have been blessed with God's eternity. We are the instruments of his divine will. Okay. We shall feed the hungry forever and ever. Amen. Let's simply agree that all are one and the same. In death, I mean. Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your urges and kneel before the Lord in praise. These urges. You know the hunger will never be satisfied. Well, true. I've come to embrace the everlasting craving. I have sworn to feed only upon the flesh of the dead. It is now my sacrament. Take, eat. This is my body. So saith the Lord. Wait, what? No. Hint required. What? Hmm. Why am I missing a hint? Wait, I, I need to Google this shit. <laughs> Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna return to main menu. <laughs> oh god, I hope this doesn't like lock me in because I mean it's gonna suck if it does lock me in because A hey. Okay, we're gonna have to take the long way, hopefully. Uh. Uh, the thing is, I don't even know whether we can take the long way, but hopefully we can. It's locked, all right. Fuck, we're stuck here. I'll go back to the
I don't want to kill Sean Hampton. I want to. <laughs> no. It's locked. Well, <sighs> fuck my life. Ah. Uh... I need to check something. <laughs> uh. Yep. Uh, I think even if I return, if I go back, I can't go back out the normal way anymore. It's locked. Unless I somehow am able to just glitch through something, I don't. I'm stuck with this. GG then. Spots brighten your skin with a new glycolic bright serum from L'Oreal Paris. Inspired by peeling procedures, the power of 1% glycolic acid reduces 57% of dark spots and in. No, I'm basically locked out because the game won't let me do what I want to do. Yep, uh, and there's no other save. I can't go back to another save. Search.
Wait a minute. Well, ah, uh, you know what? Fuck it. We're just gonna have to deal with whatever problems that we got. Uh, honestly, I was actually looking at save files. I was like, can I find a good save file? But then I was like, uh, oh well. I mean, okay. Oh, I will say one thing: the whole safe game thing, and not having additional save is a bit. Dumb. Like at least a, like another auto save or maybe, but nah. It's cause it's just gonna start me back. It doesn't matter anyway. I'm like GG fucked because to be honest, it's locked. Uh, I wonder if I can talk to her again. Like I do. Why did you have to lock the fucking doors, you dumb bitch? Uh, I'm I'm angry. I'm molding right now because I don't want to kill Sean. And to be honest, I was thinking about turning Sean actually. But now it don't matter because I can't fucking leave. I thought at least I can leave here. It's locked, all right. Unless I somehow kill myself, which is like highly improb impossible to kill myself because uh, let me just go back then. Well, I'm not gonna erase, so... Like I say, we got no choice, so we're just gonna have to deal with 
Whatever consequences, consequences that I did not choose because I was given literally no fucking choice. <laughs> Uh, because now that is my only exit and I cannot exit any other place and I mean essentially it's like literally I'm forced to like uh, well it is what it is fuck it I guess I'll just kill Sean then I don't want to kill him, but... Because I'm definitely not going to spare him, because a skull, like, I don't... Like, it do I feel like it doesn't really matter. Like, I feel like he's still going to turn, because... It's not necess... Uh, how do I say this, right? It's not because, oh, like, I don't have faith. It's just, like, even if I wanted to believe, he can, you know, not turn into... He can resist it doesn't matter because this is like how do i say it's changing your body biologically i guess in a way so i kind of wish you could just like back out from here what your we are you does this place belong to you how can you be so this the door snap. So I <coughs> Harriet. I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm certain you've killed. I will strive to emulate your merciful nature. Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Mm. Return to main menu. I don't know. Dude, I really can't. <laughs> I just don't. I don't like it. I mean, I could just straight up use a different save. I mean... Okay, you know what? Let, let's just test this out. Uh, I know I usually don't I'm I'm usually not this kind of person, you know, like okay, you know. But I don't know, like I said, I never really choose this. It's not my fault. Well technically it is my fault because you know I wasn't paying attention. Alright, I said this is a, this is gonna be a test. I like I, said, I usually don't do this, but I just wanted to see if at least I can try to like. One. Hey, we're gonna modify files. <laughs>
Who knows? This might. Well, uh, to be honest, I have a feeling this might also just break the game in general, but we'll see. I already made a backup, so... I mean, if I don't like it, then I'll just fuck it. I'll just go back to... I'll just use back the one, and then we'll just kill Sean, I guess. Even though I didn't want to kill anyone. Yeah, the thing is, it's also not on hard mode. But let's see where this one is, though. Yep, no. You know what? No. I can't. I can't do this. It's just not me. Fuck it. Ah. Uh... The thing is, I want it to be on... Uh, I guess not many people play games on hard, I guess. Hmm. <laughs> Hmm, well, I mean, there is one more I could try. This is so stupid. <laughs> I, this is really stupid. Uh, I guess I just have to live with what I've done, like they say, right? Hmm. Fuck you, game.
All right. Let's give this one more shot. If not, like I said, we'll just fuck it. We'll just roll uh I think this is one of the worst I wouldn't say worse. Yeah, I understand what they were going for to be Yeah, I understand what they were going for, right? Yeah, they were trying to go for like, you know whatever decision you make, you gotta you gotta live with it, right? And, I mean, understandable, but here's the thing. It's like, I was kind of not, well, not to say what, like, like I said, I want to just, because the decision itself, there was two. Obviously, the third one, I assume, is you have to, you can turn Sean, but... The fact that I can't turn Sean. Nope. Uh, okay. Uh, fuck it. Yep. GG. We're just not gonna bother. It is what it is. We're just gonna deal with it. Deal with whatever decision. So we're just gonna have to kill Sean. As much as I don't want to. We're just gonna have to kill him. It's gonna happen. Cause fuck this game <laughs> but no seriously fuck this game like uh just the whole thing itself all right let me just get rid of like the fucking additional save in this save file first then we'll restart the game because fuck you and everything you stand for like i said i'm not gonna change my game to like normal so GG. Right. At this rate, I'm just gonna speed run through this game. <laughs> I don't care about the trying to what anymore. Well, not really, just joking, but still though. I don't know, like I said, it just makes no sense that uh why would you lock that fucking door? At least let me go out through like the short, the other shortcut, you know, instead of like locking both fucking doors. Uh, oh god, did I just break the game? Now the game's not launching at all. I probably did. I probably somehow broke the fucking game. It's not launching at all now. Oh, there it is. Alright. Whatever happens, happen. Because I can't escape anymore. I can't, there was, there's no second exit. So, I'm stuck. <laughs> Fuck! Take responsibility for your actions. Uh, but some of these actions are not even my choice. It's because I'm literally stuck, and I can't escape. I can't kill myself. So how? So yeah, fuck you too. Yeah, I'm gonna be like, I'm I'm salty. I'm super fucking salty right now. <clears throat> because there's no other exit but there. You know what? I'm desperate. Let's try. Let's try it again. 
Maybe there's other ways? I know there's no other way. I'm literally just coping right now. I don't want to kill. But I don't want to spare him because he's a skull. <laughs> right? Well, I mean, yes, we technically have old Bridget. Right? And she's a skull, but she's not feeding on humans, right? But the thing is, Sean... I don't think Sean is like old Bridget. Old Bridget... I mean, you literally have the name old in it. She's probably like a hun, like probably older than you. Right, Sean is essentially like you, a newly born skull. He's not going to be able to resist, that's the problem. It's locked. Mm -hmm, open up, open up. <sighs> Can't jump because no fall damage, no way to kill myself. <laughs> and again, no other exit, so. Oh! Like they said, like I said, this is a. Bad situation. I had to lock the door. Uh, you didn't have to lock the door, let's be real. If Ascalon forces were to come here, you're fucked either way. That gate is not gonna hold you. I cannot enter. Imagine if somehow I was just able to like glitch through. Eh. Oh, if I kill Sean, that means I need. Oh, I just have to prepare to start fucking healing people, I guess, because. I'm actually honestly thinking of I, I don't know why I'm actually thinking about just fucking not playing this game. <laughs> uh, like I said, I don't mind choosing a bad decision, you know. What I don't like is that back. What I don't like is that I cannot fix my mistake. You we are gone. You we the fuck up. This. Oh. Who? I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm sorry. Let Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your orgies. Ah. <sighs> Why? Why? Why do you need a hin? Just let me turn him, you piece of shit. Ah. Uh. I really would like to believe your fairy tale. The good ghoul feeding upon the flesh of the dead. But I'm all out of innocence. Do you question my fate, Dr. Reed? Do you remember William? Oh, how his admiration for you was exceeded only by his hunger. May his soul rest in peace. A night will come, and you will suffer the same hunger. Someone who trusts you completely, a friend, will die never to wake. You confuse your voracious appetite with my itchy hunger. I would never kill a friend, nor an innocent. I believe you've discovered our defining difference. No! no. Ah! I did! Oh. Ah. 
I didn't choose this. The snow game, the snow Sean, I did not choose this. I profusely apologize, but I did not choose to kill you. Another corpse thrown in the streets. Someone's playing a vet. Very sick game. Good evening, Mr. Dr. Reed. Did you see what happened to him? Actually, yes. He was thrown from the roof like a vulgar log. Why is it that you sound... You didn't see it. He was dead before he hit the ground. The strength required to do such a thing, well, it beggars belief. Who could have... Who? Well, a vampire, of course. Look, bite marks on the neck and lacerations here. There is definitely a vampire close by. Goodbye. Good evening, Mr. Throgmorton. Goodbye. I need to check on the corpse. I know this brooch. This is my mother's. A birthday gift from father. Uh oh. Twenty nine Pretty Orchard Street. That's near Poplar's district. Why would this man carry off my mother's brooch? I must go there. The district will soon suffer because of whatever. Uh, right. You know what? Let's do it. Fuck it. Uh, let's see what happens now. I try not to embrace any more people, but uh, with the game being it is, I don't know who or what I might accidentally do. Alright. Use this. Should I go for... No, not, not stamina. You know what? Let's go for some more blood. Fatigue, fatigue, anemia, co co, so two co, two fatigue, one anemia, one headache, so two anemia, alright. Time to just heal the sick. I had no choice, game. Because the game did not give me a choice, I couldn't do shite. You again. Did you see what uh, No, I didn't. Really? Because this sexist pig is one of Do you need medical I may? 
I don't charge. All right then. All right, we're just well. gonna move along. Glad to see. Did you? No. You I... saw no. No. A woman. Of course. It was terrible. Yeah. Uh. Do you need? I can keep. Of course. Thank you. Goodbye. Man. Good evening, sir. I am not safe. I should... You're much safer. Bullets kill people quicker than diseases and epidemics, Dr. Reed. Do you have reason? He has been killed, you know. First... What can you tell me about this district? The East End Docks only knows one rule. Dog eat dog, and blood calls for blood. The gang will have their revenge on me one way or another. All right. Not him. What can you tell me about the most people would say that Sean Jack Gillingham, you say? Yeah, he was. Randy. Your friend Jack has something to Jack is dead. If you really believe you Jack told me once that a real hero does Whatever. Goodbye. Now I need to find Ichibo. I have no idea where he went. <laughs> he went somewhere. Hmm. I mean, the only places he probably could have gone. Oh no, he's here. Okay. I can't protect the whole city. It's hard enough to cover. Good evening, Mr. Doctor Reed. Do you need my? Uh, Treating a thank. You. Goodbye. All right. So next, I need to get my butt. Uh, Alright, I need to get my butt back to the lime docks here, so... I had no choice game You never gave me a choice I was forced to eat someone I did not want to eat <laughs> Well I mean technically I could have let him live but uh, I don't know what the consequences would have of that will be. Evening, Rufus. Evening, Miss. Do you need help? A real doc. A real doctor. I don't know what. To do. So long. All right. I'm just literally just going Good everywhere. Evening, Mrs. Fishburne. Of course. And. Please don't stay too long, sir. What can I do for? Do you have any? What a terrible storm. Mrs. Fishburne. I am a. F then let. I think. Goodbye. Now, <coughs> well, like I said, that's the reason why. Welcome back. Have you? Have you not heard? 
Why does your waitress feel in danger working on the docks? This part of town is dangerous. Do you think she has good reason? Of course I. Do you need... <coughs> Indeed. Oh, Goodbye. Times like these are good drinks just as it like didn't the problem as to solve You one. still work. Do you require... Me? Don't feel... Goodbye. Alright, let's see. I feel everyone. Alright, that's good. Now let us go to bed and see what happens after that again. Okay, so it's a constant battle for what then, I guess? Fatigue, fatigue, fatigue. So three fatigues, okay. Alright, so I basically just need to constantly keep a lookout. Let's just heal these people first, and then after that, we'll try try not to sleep. Then. Good evening. Hello. The murderer is still unknown. Can I offer you my? Giving him. Goodbye. All right. Uh. Uh. What the fuck? Good, good evening. Do you need my medical info? Never. Goodbye. Uh, I'll try not to sleep that often then. I mean, I just wanted to test to see what happens. Uh, I guess, I mean, technically it would never be stable ever again, so... Yeah, I've, uh, I think yeah, this place will never be stable ever again. Because I think you, if in order to be stable, you need to have a pillar. So they're just going to keep getting sick over and over again. Well, looks like it's time to take care of this place then. Good evening. There's no need. Young man, I don't. No, thank you. Show me what... I'm not gonna heal. All right. Maybe I should go from here instead, cause... No, not this way. Yeah, look, I'm unhappy. I'm truly am. Cause I didn't mean it. 
Bro, at this rate, right, it's like, I really need to, like, just talk to everybody. Vermin. Okay. I swear to God, sometimes these people have like the there. Pretty Orchard Street. This is it. What's in there for me? There's been a fight here. This window was shattered with violent force. Someone's been pulled through it and dragged through the street. Who could have done that? Hmm. The bloody trail. Over 
Bitey bitey. Power of the Lord. There we go. woman's neck were made by the fangs of a vampire. This is the very flower my mother tossed on Mary's coffin. Someone is targeting my family. Shoes and clothes are quite worn out. I see you. Oh. Right then. It's a sick game. But given no choice in the matter, I might as well win it. Let you escape. Mm. Very fast, but I'll catch you. Dead inside. They've all been butchered. Mm. I wonder. I mean, it must be somebody that knows me. I mean, he, she literally called. The vampire literally called me by name, so... Holy shit. Everyone's been butchered. The skulls... I can still sense a presence.
have you done? What? Vicar Larrabee. What happened? Demon. Hell Scourge. Son of perdition. Vicar. Vicar. Jonathan's no demon. He's just a soul. Mary? From the dead. Like your Christ, Vicar. Mary? Is it really you? Oh, it's me, all right. Precious brother. What is mother doing here? I'm gathering the family for a final reunion. All smiling, all dead. Thanks to the good Dr. Reed. Mary. Mother? <laughs> say hello to your son. Hello, Jonathan. Mother, I... What do we have here, mother? The prodigal son has lost his tongue. Our Jonathan always had the first and last word at dinner. The entertainer, the star of our show. I'm sorry. Let me explain. Shut up. It's my turn to do the talking. I have this nasty hole in my chest, Johnny. It needs to breathe. Of course. You can speak. My prayers went so long without an answer. My husband killed in France. My child carried away by the flu. My brother promising to return in his letters, then disappearing in thin air. I went from hospital to hospital, cemetery to cemetery, grave to grave. I've lifted every stone in London, searching for an end to the nightmare. And there you were, in front of me, on a dark pier. The hunger had taken me. The joy to have finally found you. I longed for your arms, a final happy ending to so much tragedy, to tell me all would be well again, as you did when we were children. <laughs> it was this filthy dock where you greeted your sister. I dug. A tunnel from my grave with my fingers and teeth! Mary. I thought I had murdered you. I tried to end myself. We've been through the same horror. We are a disease, Jonathan. A sickness that corrupts all it touches. All we kiss. And all we kill. Look at me. Admire your ilk. I'm so sorry. Oh. Apologies will not suffice. I demand reparation. I want a miracle. Are you a miracle worker, Dr. Reed? No? <laughs> I'll show you mine then. The family Reed. Reunited and complete. Living forever in a red sea of eternal love. Mm. Time to go, mother. Say hello to my son, for Mary. Me. Wait. I have made friends with vital knowledge, vampires. We are not alone, Mary. With time, we can learn to live almost as we lived before. How long? What? How long will this masquerade continue? I've been watching you. All these knights in Whitechapel pretending you're still a doctor. You believe you're just fighting a disease. But it's you, the disease, Jonathan, you! I'm a scientist. I'll find a solution. Let our mother go, please. You're always the one to sway me to reason, Jonathan. But before, your motivations were always pure. Now you're tainted. Let her go! She has no part to play in this. <clears throat> Very well. Have you heard our good doctor? You can go home, mother. Go home and rest in peace. Yes, I'll go home and rest. <laughs> it's so easy to make them obey or forget puppets for our pleasure. I've seen you have your fun. You are mad. <laughs> So that's what I am, Doctor. Mad. I was beginning to wonder. I I've been hearing these voices in my head. One in particular. That of my dead brother. 
This is the reason I must kill you. Not for your betrayal. Not for our poisonous kiss. Not even for the lies you tell yourself. No. It's so that smooth and wicked voice will stop ringing in my ear. Mary. No, don't! Time to die, brother. And this time for good. Uh-oh. Boss fight? Slayer! Holy shit, what the fuck is that? You killed me, brother. I didn't mean to. I didn't know. I thought you were dead. Come on, Mary. Be reasonable. You've spared the precious nurse Crane, but not your own Mary. Well, I mean, at the time, it's not. Kiss me again. Final thoughts are just to die Holy for. Shit. Okay, this boss is like. Rest in peace, monster. I mean, let's be real, you're more of a monster than me now. <laughs> My God. Rest in peace, monster. Again, not my fault. Fuck, dude. Okay, this boss fight is going to be. And this boss fight is gonna be very, 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 very not good. <laughs> Ah! 
What? That wave? Okay. <laughs> oh god. Dude, this boss fight is gonna be a... It's gonna be a toughie. the precious nurse crane but not your own mary kin slayer rest in peace monster give me your blood priest final thoughts are just to die for oh god fight is like so I I'm just gonna be pure focusing on this
Fuck me. I really hate when the... When the ability like just spread all around. Makes it hard to like really... Again, sweet brother. Uh. Oh no! Fuck off! Ah. All right, I'm just gonna have to. Well, not to say do anything. Can't do anything. I'm gonna be pure focusing. I I'm not gonna even. You left me to rot. <laughs> what have you done? Hey, that fucking shockwave is so stupid. <sighs> right, just you know what? Let's do this as well. No, 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 no. Shut up, Vicar. Kills me, brother. Come to me, Jonathan. Yeah. <laughs> 
No. Oh. They're fucking. Dude. Uh. I don't understand why that shockwave is an insta kill. I I really don't. Maybe if I had high health, it's not an insta kill, but it still makes no sense of why it's still an insta kill. Bro, this boss itself is gonna take so many tries. Fuck, even dude, even Fergus didn't even take this long, man. I didn't kill you! Rest in peace, monster. Yes. That, that fucking magnet attraction. What have you 
You need to be careful. She's not get. Uh, she's like not getting stunned as much as like normal already. Okay. I'm gonna have to primarily focus on healing. Come to me, Jonathan. Try use the ultimate as much as I can. If I have to stall for time, bitch, I will stall for time. Kiss me again, brother. Uh, first of all, I didn't even kiss you, so I don't know what the fuck y'all on about. It's like a maze trying to Oh my god, she actually can show you the same kindness you showed Sean Hampton. Oh, come on, don't remind me of Sean Hampton. I didn't mean to kill him. Holy shit, she's much more aggressive now. Okay, she's definitely much more fucking aggressive. Fergus is not this aggressive. No, no, no. Come to me, Jonathan. How about you fuck off? My dear sister. Just trying to sub <laughs> Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! What have you done? Done nothing! I'm dead. Fuck off! Oh my god, this boss is an asshole. All right.
I'm gonna have to use something else. I don't know. I need to get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. I literally cannot kill her. Dude, that final phase is just stupid, man. She's just way too aggressive. I barely could do anything to her, man. not even like I don't even think it's like abilities you know Add more stun, it's gonna be I'm basically just trying to think of like what I can use right now. I got no ammo, so fuck that. Let's try this then. Or maybe, maybe I should just try and do this. Because most of the time I just refuse to use this. But at this rate, I may actually need it, so... Alright, 
Alright, you know what? Let's just use this on them. I need some blood anyway. Honestly, the stun is not very good. Like, if you compare it to, say, a pre wound stick stun versus this stun. Mm, you know what? I know I'm basically wasting resources, but... <coughs> 31 stun... For 40 stamina... Versus... 31.5... Let's just try double stun. Honestly, just working my ass off right now. Because I need to test other weapons, that's the problem. Just to see what. Just to die for. Kiss me again, sweet brother. Kinslayer! Ah! 
Maybe I should actually just like lava my autophagy. Fuck! Oh, finally! Oh. Lord have mercy, this boss is fucking difficult. Well, brother, it's time to bring this conversation to an end forever. You know I will not play this game. Calm now, Doctor. Like a rabid dog. Or think you're performing an autopsy. Don't be ridiculous. I'll kill them all. The kind Dr. Swansea. The sweet little lass with hair of red. I am the harbinger bringing your punishment. Mary. Don't you see? This is not me. Flesh that never ages. All nightmare. No dream. Bring it to a close. Let me sleep. I will find a cure, Mary. I swear it. Then, at last, I can forgive you. Okay, 
not gonna lie, this boss is really not easy. Fuck, that Liston knife really, really helped out a lot. Nice later. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, that boss made me sweat like nobody's business. Jesus, Mary, you're like one of the hardest boss I fought in this game. Blood. As I shed one last red tear for my <laughs> fallen sister, I realize the entire world now revolves around this singular word. The epidemic that has stricken London is not the Spanish flu. It is transmitted through the blood, via violent biting, turning survivors into frenzied immortals. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am a vampire, born anew into an age of death and pestilence. While plotting factions close in around me, I am sworn to find the source of this epidemic. I am convinced greater perils are still to come. I know the answers I seek are hiding in our blood. I wonder if that counts as me sleeping. Eh, what the fuck? Petite for Loxy Pets. Hey, yo, what? The hell? Okay. Let me double check. We're gonna go here like everyone. So fatigue, anemia, fatigue, anemia. So two anemia. So far two anemia. Two fatigue. Three fatigue. Co fatigue. Okay. Uh, I lost one of the one of the event just now. I could I could have talked to Lady Ashbury. Jonathan, old chap. I was conducting with. Of course. Of. Have you any reliable? Unfortunate. What about? There are only a few of us. Most of. What of my commission? Nothing to fear, Jonathan. What news? The news is not good, my friend. How bad? It is killing the infected patients faster. In less than two days. Tell me more. Jeffrey McCallum seems to have sent his war dogs on. Have they come? No. They mainly. F Tell me, Jeff. Have they. Yeah. No. I have received an alarming letter. Then you are twice fortunate. Is the quarry. It is helping. Why have you never- My dear Jonathan, you- I'm Thank just skipping dialogues already because at this point I'm just way too bored to listen to dialogues. Uh, Alright. Where are all the people that are dying? I'm quite- Do you need- Don't be- Then you are- I wish- Thank you for you. I'm- Give 
Good evening, Mr. Fiddick. Good evening. Is there any... Really? Um... Goodbye for... You always knew the words to calm the children, Helen. As for me... What a stop, blunder, stop. idiot. Okay, what? Uh, hello, hello, stop. Good evening, sir. Dude, the game is literally not in my control. I cannot do anything. Good evening, Doc. Do you recall? Do you know? Well, it Good. Don't waste your time with me. Shit, just... You guys can't see it, but the game was literally not in my control earlier. I couldn't do anything. I was like... The, the character just kept moving. Alright, Rakesh... Pandana... Good evening. Good evening. Do you need? Enough. Not. Thank you. Goodbye. I'm literally just skipping a lot of like uh, the one. Hey, where is Rakesh? I thought I came up to Rakesh. Where the hell is he? Since you know, do you I goodbye? Never ceases to amaze me how you peaceful. It's locked. Good evening, Dr. B. Such a pleasure. Goodbye. It never ceases to amaze me how you, the dead, seem. Even sold you. No. I wish I could As long. Goodbye. Oh, disgust on every street corner. A daily routine. This we need to go to White Chapel. Good, e Good evening. Why? I was just buying it because I got the money to spend. So. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, Doc. Do you need? I'm afraid. Oh, that's easy. Good evening. Good evening. Do you require? I will be. No. <laughs> Last person to heal. It's outside. It's locked. I'll probably stop here. I'm just gonna go around like healing everybody first before we do anything. Oh, we st oh yeah, now we have match my tree. I can finally talk to this piece piece of shit. <laughs> this guy over here. All right. Hello again, Mr. Black. Good evening. Do you need fight? Your work. Goodbye, Mr. All right, off to White Chapel.
patients are not fools. They know we are overwhelmed. This is no place for a jet. See that fence close? This will cut off. Leveled up as well. Over there! There's one Seems like there's a lot more vampires or skulls or whatever. They're all level 23 as well. When people buy guns, I'd like to. You know what? Goody. I think I might I'd buy like some more. Uh. Which one? You never... Right then.
I'm just using up money. You never lose. Do you need to be honest? I don't really. Goodbye. You again? Can I off keep you? There is a all right. Goodbye. Good evening. His father. Don't you fight? No, that's good. I have had. Right. Rest to evolve. I don't want to. Well, not right now, anyway. Blood Econ. Good evening, sir. Leave me alone. It cannot be safe. Well, avoid. What kind of gentleman pays visits to people at this late hour? The kind that wants to suck your blood. That's it. Tell me, how do you? It's locked, all right. So what if I'm Dr. Dr. Reed, the eminent surgeon? My God, I'd never have expected a brilliant physician like you to knock on my door. You flatter me, sir. No, sir, I am flattered. I read all your work when I still had my sight. I loved it. I'm Mason Swanborough, by the way. All right, let's do this first. Seem Actually, yes, thank you. And what else have you learned about me, Mr. Swanborough? I know you assisted Professor Carell in France, and that you invented a new blood transfusion method based on his work. Yes. Those were frustrating but exciting days. I loved it. Yes, the thrill of research and discovery. This is what drives people like us, Dr. Reed. Oh, how I envy you. Does someone take care of you in this isolated place? My sister Loretta and I have our daily routine. Every morning and evening she comes by so we can talk and eat. Then she leaves and I stay. Do you not appreciate your sister's visits? Loretta is the best and worst thing that happened to me. And I believe she could say the same thing about me. Where does your sister... Well, let's just... What, so... Am... I won't hide the truth from you. Loretta sells a fake miracle elixir to the sick people of Whitechapel. So, Mason, you are the creative one in the Swanborough business, are you not? Yes, I am. I am the one who invented and improved the family recipe. And you do it all by yourself? Blind? and isolated in this laboratory. My eyes may be useless, but my brain is still sharp. Once a chemist, always a chemist. Mason, why would you waste your skill and knowledge on crafting snake oil and fake drugs? But this is my only opportunity to continue practicing my art. By giving false hope to desperate people? They all see me as disabled and useless. I'm sick of their pity. 
To accept what has happened to us and what we have become is a difficult process. I'm sorry for what you've had to endure. You'll not get my respect through cheap compassion, Doctor. Speak to me like I'm a normal human being. That's all I ask. Is your sister using you and your skills for her own profit? I've lost my sight, not my wits. Loretta couldn't manipulate me in a million years. Are you sure about that? You clearly depend on her. Let me be perfectly clear. I came up with the idea of the Swanborough Cordial. Loretta needs me more than I need her. Do you know Braille, Mr. Swanborough? I'm no expert, but I learned it in my spare time, yes. Why? I found a strange document entitled Cure for Blindness. It's written in Braille, so I thought perhaps it was yours. Really? Is that some kind of sick joke? Let me see. Here it is. This letter seems authentic. And it actually refers to an experimental cure for blindness. You have piqued my interest, Dr. Reed. Ooh. Could it be of any use to you? No. This page is just a part of a larger diary. I'd be glad if you could find the other pages. I found another page of the diary, Mr. Swanborough. This diary is still not complete. The man who wrote it claims he is a member of some scholarly brotherhood called the St. Paul's Stole. Really? I've heard of them. Very capable scientists. Perhaps the man who wrote this really found a cure. I would need more pages to figure it out, but it's as promising as it is intriguing. Here is another page of the diary we were talking about. Ah, now we're talking. Ingredients, dosages, dangers and side effects, this is it. Is the diary complete now? No. The author tested his work in a hidden laboratory. We must find out where it was. Please, find me more pages, Doctor. Alright. Well, uh, for now, we don't have any more pages, so... Goodbye. What kind of gentleman pays visits to people at this lake? We'll come back another time, until we find the last piece. For now, I'ma just yeet myself. Bloody monster! Hey, 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 hey. Shit indeed. Mm. I kind of want to try fighting them. Getting gangbang. Yo, I just got gangbang. What the fuck? Okay. If you're not strong enough, remember that the blood of the citizen is the fastest way to evolve. Okay. <laughs> you don't say. Uh, at least we're in Whitechapel. Alright, um... Okay, I think I've healed everyone in Whitechapel. The only one is dogs, but I have a feeling it, uh, even if I heal her, she's still gonna like... If I go to sleep, it's gonna get more... More people's gonna be like infected or like get sick. Alright, I need to find a way to like get alright, uh well there is no other way besides this
One thing I will say, the Liston knife is like fucking. I wouldn't say OP, but it's definitely like. Right, if you're using a lot of, if you like to use a lot of abilities, yeah, the Liston knife is gonna be very good. Let's go to the docks. I mean, it's a long way, but unless I wait, do I know a shortcut to the docks? Though? Yeah, I'm pretty sure they're probably. I think after this I'm gonna upgrade my auto Feiji. No evil. Stay back. I shall fear no evil for I am fear incarnate. Again, Lottie Paxton, all right.
Alright, so what we're gonna do We're gonna just save uh, Not save, but like Heal and then rest up So we'll just probably just evolve And hopefully The dogs doesn't Suffer too much, but Like I said, without Sean Hampton It's literally just like it's fucked basically <laughs> I mean as long as it can stay on the stable then it should be fine because I think stable won't really affect It's locked, all right. Glad. Do you have reason? I can't believe that. Are you what? There were rumors. As long as you. I hope. Do you need? I can. Of course. Thank you. Good. All right. Now. I'm gonna go and do this. And then we're gonna just rest. Uh, yeah, like I said, I've been meaning to level up this one. Might as well. Alright, what's this? You trade instant health gain for a greater regeneration. Trade more blood to heal yourself instantly and gain an additional boost on. Okay, so current boost is 10. I mean, either way, it's like 15. Hmm. Well, I can only choose one, so... Let's just try. Blood barrier. Vampires afraid of suffering damage. What's this again? Two seconds control. You'll block targets. Okay. Alright, let's see how bad it is. Yep, uh, I knew it. Uh. Holy shit, new people are getting sick every time? What the fuck? Alright. Okay, so I w I'm still just gonna go and heal them. Doesn't matter. So we're just gonna heal them. So we got a co two coals, right? Okay. We're not gonna sleep after this, cause I mean, there's no point in sleeping anyway. So 
We're just gonna go two co one uh two headaches, three headaches. Two co three uh four co okay we have enough co but headaches is the prop. Back to <laughs> Whoa. Nani? Okay, yeah, I'm keeping the Liston knife. <laughs> Yeah, you know, I mean, if I don't want to use the bite damage, mm, we'll see. I said for now we need to heal uh, Rodney Grader. Good evening. You? Do you need death by? Well, you would... goodbye. All right. After that, we're gonna go. Oh yeah, Boof Digby, right? So... Oh well, I say it's not like we have much of a choice anyway. I could actually use that. Uh,
That's it. Vicious bugger. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, I'm just gonna book it. We're just gonna rot. Nice. I'm just. I want to heal. I just want to heal and then just fuck right off because I don't want to fight. Here that has uh, Tippins, Corbin, and Telma. Any pit? I have. Goodbye. This is new. Miss Talma Hawkrow. Good evening. Do you recall? I can. Well, thank you, Doctor. I'll. Good evening. Good evening. Do you need my would have been? Good. I will not let you down, my boy. Then at least we heal them. The last people that I need to heal is in White Chapel. Cadogan Bates and Shell Suit. Then... Oh. You know what? Fuck it. Upgrade everything that we can. So I can either do more damage or... Ooh. I think I might wait for this one because this one seems... To... No. Mm -mm. Let's see. But I would need to get... Oh uh, well. One stun. Okay. All 
Alright, I'm just gonna go and heal some people at Whitechapel, then we're back. Fuck off, man. I just want to get to White Chapel. <sighs> All right. Since the game wants to be shitty with me I too can be shitty with them Come on. I'ma just say it, the Liston knife, definitely a very good weapon. Especially if you're trying to like Time to find Shao Shun and was it Cadogan Beat too? Was it? Yep, okay. Good evening. One. How do you. I... You should. Thank you. Goodbye. The Swanborough Cordial can be the answer to all your problems. Perhaps I should look into it. Here, I know things. 
Miss Eve. Since I well, and what? All right. Goodbye. So for now, we are done. We're not going to be sleeping anytime soon. So healing all done for now. Because I have a feeling we're going to be healing a lot more after this. This one, I just need one last one. So yeah, we're gonna not gonna not fast travel. We're just gonna run over there because there's no fast travel system in this game. fight this dude down here but I'm too lazy to I don't know why I feel like going in here but Okay, that was easy as shit. Yeah, we're there's no next we are stopping here for today so yeah uh anyways thank you all for coming to stream really appreciate it if you guys leave a like and subscribe really helps on the channel other than that i shall see you guys in the next one which is next week all right this is fat boy signing off uh, bye bye